Now, there are several things that need to be uh, analyzed. Normally, we bypass enterprise architecture, right? And we either go directly to a, a software developer or we go to the systems person and say, well, these are the changes. But, but this is with our limited vision and limited knowledge. Of, and uh, so we know which stakeholder to go to, but it's not necessarily complete. Remember the picture, the five domains of enterprise architecture from strategy all the way to infrastructure. So the next thing happens is this task, after it's being analyzed and specific requirements are being identified, it goes next to, next slide, to your enterprise architect. Now, system architect has exploited the capabilities of OSLC it does communicate with national team concert, and we have in the releases of system architect, the latest releases, we have reports. Uh, the reporting engine is capable at this point to report on any OSLC links to external systems. So the first thing you do then is you have, the, the by, by assigning a change request to Bob, which is the requirement management uh, that identifies the requirements and reassign it to the enterprise architect. Two things the enterprise architect received is the change request and the, 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 the requirements are being impacted. Therefore, the enterprise architect at that point will write a report, looks for any elements, model elements in the, in the system architect that, has this, that are OSLC linked to those requirements. But from that perspective, they can realize, they can determine that there's, by, by changing this requirement, your architecture is going to be changed. So the next logical thing, part of the demo would be, is to create an explorer diagram and then find the impact analysis of this change to the rest of the requirement. Let's say if I take a system function and go that one more time, it has data stores and it has business processes being implemented on a higher level. Uh, from that, I can determine that uh, what service needs to be changed, the data, uh, the data infrastructure needs to be changed, so I need to involve a DBA, and I need to involve my development team, and it could be very well, my system needs to be done. So it could be anything, like think of a change